So I'm out here driving in my 2010 Dodge Caliber and I've noticed my gauge just stopped working. I turned the car off, turned it on, started driving and I just happened to look down and the gauges aren't working. If you look around, you can see I am driving. I'm, I'm out here driving. The only way I can tell how fast I'm going, I have to look at my navigator. As you can see, I am out here driving and the gauges are not moving. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. I'm gonna figure out what's going on and I'll be right back. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna disconnect my battery. Use this look, not the whole battery, just maybe just the negative. Okay. So I disconnected the battery. You know, give it a few seconds before I reconnect it. And then we'll see what happened from there. So actually I waited about two minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and tighten this battery back up. Make sure my bolt is in there nice and tight. The one thing about using these crescent wrenches, you gotta make sure it's adjusted properly because you can strip the nut that's in there. So just be careful when you're doing this part. That's all I'm gonna do. I connected my battery and let's go to find out what happens. This is my king here. Voila. All right. As you can see, everything is working again. So if this happens to you, definitely unplug your battery, plug it back up, and you should be good to go. So don't get paranoid, don't get scared, and don't think about running to no mechanic um, to spend all your money. Because, you know, they would love to take your money, park your car in the shop for about two hours just to do what I just did, and then tell you come get it, and then charge you an arm and a leg. All right, I hope this helps somebody. Thanks for watching everybody.